what is going on youtube this is your boy rj back with another video for you guys and this is a video of it telling you guys and explaining to you guys how to get paul pierce um what is the you know normal basis of how unlimited works this year a lot of people have gave me the question or was giving me the question in the stream like yo how does unlimited work this year is it 12 and 0 um you know do i just gotta win 12 games or you know stuff like that and no this is a process of winning games it doesn't i'm not gonna say it doesn't matter about losing because yes the further into tiers if you lose that's gonna be on you so without further ado before we get started make sure to like button subscribe if you're new to the screen the vibes as always you know we rock you know we do let's get lit follow the twitch as well everything will be in the link in the description and like i said before comment down below in the section where are you at unlimited right now how's the process going for you and how is your team looking so far but Without further ado, I'm gonna break down every tier um, from where I started to uh, me getting Paul Pierce. I'm gonna show you only the bigger, uh, I'm gonna show you a couple of clips of my Amethyst, um, uh, my Amethyst reward, my Diamond reward, and my Pink Diamond reward. Because when you get to the Opal, the only thing you can get from the Opal reward tier is the card Paul Pierce himself. So first off, we started off from Silver. Um, silver, you only have to play three games. Uh, which is easy, right? You know what I'm saying? You win three games, you go to the next tier, which the next tier is gold. So in gold, you had to win four games. So in gold, you win four games. If you had, um, if you win two games, you can still stay in that tier. Uh, so, you know, my silver rewards were all silver players. It was three cards. My gold rewards were all gold. Well, not all silver players. Sorry about that. It was a silver player, a contract, and a badge. My gold was the same a gold player a, a gold badge and a gold contract now the next tier after that is emerald so when you get to emerald you have to win i believe it's six six games yeah so you have to win six games at emerald you have to win three games to stay in that tier so pretty much if you win three games you can stay in that tier but if you used to lose the rest of the games then you know what i'm saying you have to redo that tier over again but you have to win six games to advance the next tier after emerald was ruby um ruby you have to win seven games you have to win four games um to stay within that tier uh and you know the word you know you, pretty much you're starting to get the gist of how things is going where you gotta in order to stay in that tier you gotta win the games at the mark and then if to advance you have to win up to those amount of games itself so from the ruby tier it then goes into the well, actually i think it's the sapphire tier i always get that kind of confused where it's ruby and sapphire sapphire then ruby but i know within those lines the next games after that you have to win eight games and then you have to go ahead from that pinpoint you win eight games you win four games to stay in the tier and you go from there from that tier it goes into having to do amethyst now amethyst you had to win i believe amethyst was nine games um and then i believe it was six six games to stay in that tier nine games to win it um and then diamond was 10 games you had to you had to do you had to stay in a tier i think it was i think I, I think it was seven to stay in and then you know 10 to advance and then of course pink diamond which was uh 11 wins um and i think it was maybe nine or eight wins to stay in that tier it's like it's like the 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 better the better the tier the more losses you can't get um opal tier you had to literally go 12 and 0. if you lose a game you drop back simple as that when you get to that opal tier as you can see like right here on my screen i'm just showing the opal tier like you know I mean, if you guys want to put together a video to break down and show you guys like pictures and stuff like that in the video, let me know. But I'm just really explaining this to you guys because I know that you have to go back. I had like a 19 hour stream and man, just trying to like fish for all that. I was like, I was locked in, you know, now I get to kick back and I'm not saying I get to kick back, but now I can make these videos for you guys because the fact that I was so locked in, I wasn't worried about trying to make a video or do nothing like that for this. You know, I got my paw up here, so now I can get this content out for you guys. But with the Opal tier here, you got to get 10 wins in order to stay in the tier, but you got to win 12 games. Now, just look at the look at the odds of it, though. If you lose one game, you're going to bounce back anyway because that's 13 games you have to play. So at the end of the day, it's like you cannot lose a game. You cannot lose a game in Opal tier. 
that's going to make the difference that's going to show the skill and for the ones that's grinding right now in a limited like i said before get started now because when it get when these teams get better bro and players get better overall dog it's going to be a battle for these cards especially in the opal tier win or go home and i like that it's like march madness type of feel you know what i'm saying win or go home start back over because you have to, and you have to start back over you go back a previous tier meaning you have to go back to pink diamond tier so you have to go back to pink diamonds here to get back to opal tier and do the same thing over but you cannot lose you cannot lose so without further ado i'm gonna show you guys um a couple of clips that i pretty much end up getting anyway um hopefully you guys enjoy these clips uh i'm gonna show you guys the reward i got for the amethyst i'm gonna show you guys the reward i got for the diamond and i'm gonna show you guys the reward i got for the pink diamond and i'm going to talk over that as well all right so here we go here as far as in with what we are seeing i'm going i'm actually going into um clips of what i had pulled so right there this is the first one this is the amethyst when we completed this one so we got six wins you have to get six wins remember amethyst you have to get six wins and nine wins to advance to the diamond tier diamond tier seven wins 10 wins to advance to the pink diamonds here so you guys can see right there a few things from uh, from that from that point they give you 10 cards from the amethyst to the diamond and the pink diamond they give you 10 cards out the gate it was an amethyst player bro out the gate and this is no money spent bro this is some cards that you can go in play and get this was my first pool um from the amethyst tier that they gave me and they gave your boy a a D man like out the gate of ad i was playing with the free agent ad and i was like bro if i had him on my team dog we own glad i was able to pull that card could take him into unlimited now he's on my team and i can use him in limited as well so of course here's my second pull they end up getting a ruby and a sapphire right here which is not a bad pull was able to you know got get zion and cat add to the collection now this clip right here does go into the diamond tier once i completed it um i did do this one we got the diamond tier reward and i'm gonna show you guys what i got from that so pretty much back to back to back rewards when i got those bro was nothing but beauties dog and i'm telling you the beauties and like i said grind going unlimited man you look this year in unlimited you can get some fire stuff I'm, I'm telling you you can get some fire stuff they don't show you the rewards but you can definitely get some fire cards in unlimited now it's, and it's not just empty it's not no token like you can literally get Cards. Now I've noticed that you can't get tokens. That is a big factor. You can't get tokens um in unlimited. I don't know if that's just right now, but um I don't see them giving out tokens in unlimited. But we get another amethyst card right here from the diamond. Also, a diamond contract came with this. So I'm it's looking like they're giving out good stuff. Like the pink diamond, you're gonna see after this. But we end up pulling right here the man himself, KD on the Brooklyn Nets which that was a fire pull right there because we needed a small forward already we were out there using uh i think i had i had so my team was dame clay and he i, I forgot who my third my, my third small forward my small forward was um just know that kd oh i had luca i had luca that i need to go sell i, I was not I'm, i was not rocking luca i ain't gonna lie to you but we ended up getting kd um, which was a, a, a fire pull because him added to my team already was just phenomenal right here i'm showing you the pink diamond and like i said this was the pink diamond going into the galaxy opal and yo this this pack right here set the tone now on top of this these cards that you're getting they're your owner cards you can use these cards in limited that's the best part about it you can use these cards in limited so I end up getting two diamonds, which is a diamond contract and a diamond shoe. Um, and of course, we get an amethyst pool out of this as well. So we get difficult shots. Actually, this is the badge. My bad. The next one you're going to see is an amethyst pool. But we end up getting difficult shots Hall of Fame, which was perfect because I did add that to my Paul Pierce. But here's the amethyst pool right here. We end up getting um, also a ruby and an Amy. So this pool right here set the tone for my team. And man, when I tell you guys this was it, bro. I was like, hey, we lit. We here. Let's get it. 
um but like, like i said before you guys go in unlimited man start grinding start getting right man because at the end of the day you want to get used to the online gameplay that's the best part about it especially for when these cards about to drop low-key i'm starting to see a lot of people hop in unlimited now more so than domination and that's the funny part about it because they like oh I'm do a domination i'm gonna do domination nah brother you want to hop in that unlimited dog get your cards right get right in, in online we getting up getting greek freak himself Giannis right here and i was like yes let's go add him to the rotation coming off the bench he lit but i might sell him though stay tuned here man um i just wanted to show you guys uh in regards to how to get paul pierce um the tiers of what you can get from the reward because i get that question a lot yo what do you get from the rewards from the bigger tiers so you guys can see for yourself grind the game no money spent hey man like so far so good my team is looking nice i'm gonna show you guys my team right here um so you can see from being no money spent um dame lillard paul george uh you know got the paul pierce now anthony davis shack evo actually uh so off the bench like i said i can't use kevin durant in the starting lineup because paul pierce i'd rather play him of course we're gonna play him over kd uh i got Giannis that i can i can start but i like ad more so than Giannis right now um but now my goal is to get a shooting guard because paul paul even though paul george is is good like i'm saying that alan houston card um and i'm liking him but i know you can't use them in limited that's the thing because i will have to pull him down that's the biggest thing too is like sometimes these cards you can't sometimes with these cards you can't just buy them to use in limited you have to pull them and that's the only bad part about it i would say is having to pull the cards in order to use them in limited but this is your boy rj about to sign out hit the like button if you enjoyed the video like I said, subscribe if you join Laser Crew. Appreciate everybody tuning into the videos and the content, bro. Like I said, I got more heat coming for you guys. You guys want more gameplay videos? I will drop them. If you guys want a video on how to shoot, you know, how to dribble, how to play defense, like let me know in the comment section below what you guys want to see in store. But stay in tune, bro. Let's get it.